What's going on YouTube? This is What Would Josh Do? And this is a quick video on UAG's new product. This is a wireless charging pad plus stand. Includes a rugged USB-C cable up to 15 watts for wireless charging, which is pretty awesome. Real carbon fiber inlay. MagSafe compatible. The built-in stand looks pretty cool. And there you go. It comes with a four-foot braided USB-C cable, which also we got some of these. These are five foot. Well, let's check it out. Okay, so it does come with a good looking little cable there. Wow, that actually looks very, this would be a cable I get my freaking kid, dude. It's funny, I buy her the $30 expensive uh, cables from Anchor and uh, you know they last like four months or so. And then I bought her the $10 cable from Walmart, like on or something. And it lasted like days, like literally just days. So I was like, you know what? $30 every few months. That's not too bad. And I don't like how my camera is changing. Yeah, I don't like that. That's weird. All right. We won't have that auto setting again after this. Wow. It keeps changing the video. But here's the thing so it's like slip resistant it's nice put a little bit of pressure on it it doesn't go anywhere this has like a little lip there and you can just pop that up that's cool that's super cool and the charging cable goes there in the side so we'll plug that in all right pay attention to this right here this is a 30 watt charger We'll plug that in and we'll attach this to the back of our phone. Very cool. Very cool. We got the little icon there. So it means it's the fast charging. We're going to wait for that to kick up. And of course it freaking just wants to glue itself to your phone. And not to mention this is the UAG case. But look at that, man. That's solid. That is a sturdy kickstand. Dude, that is stiff. Oh, my word. And then that's as far as it goes. So you can have it many different. Well, not many, but you can have it. You can kind of position it a little bit. Oh, yeah. We got the little. I forgot about. That's cool. That's really cool. And as you can see here, we're uh, charging at almost 12 watts. This is a 45 watt charger. That is super freaking cool. I love that so much. Be cool if they could figure out a way to like build this into the case. Like, uh, I don't know, man. Just keep it on your phone. All That's super freaking cool. All right. This is the official Apple one. We got the little charging animation there. Keep in mind, this official one is kind of old. It's been out for years now, so it's not using all the latest technology. But yeah, we're staying steady at about 8 there, so it has been like that for a few minutes now. And then this guy just friggin' just right on there. <laughs> oh man, I'm a nerd. So you can have this coming straight up, or you can twist it. And have it go to the side or you can have it go to that side but then well you really want it just this way that way that kickstand if your goal is to use the kickstand of course if you're not using the kickstand you can have it the cable coming out the bottom or the here or there or anywhere <laughs> that's pretty cool i like this thing it's awesome and you could always get an angled USB-C cable and it would angle it, you know, either coming out like this way or coming out this way. So, all right, let's open at least one of these real quick and so you can take a look at this one. You can tell it's a little bit longer. It's got this neat little thing that you wrap up in here to keep the cable snug. That's cool. I like that. But basically... It's the same thing, just uh, this one's orange and black, which I really like that color scheme a lot. 
Plus, it's a foot longer, as you can see. You got all this extra length there. You could always get, like I said, that angled USB-C cable. And then instead of coming straight out, it would basically just come this way or it would come this way. If you didn't like it being like this. If you enjoyed the video, please give it a thumbs up. If you're new to my channel, please consider subscribing. Please follow me on Twitter and Instagram. This is What Would Josh Do? And I'm out.